skincare is blowing up the internet. Never in my entire life have I been this This is my skincare routine. Me. And you literally cannot get away from it. Especially not me. We all know about my obsession with shopping and lucky me, my stash of skincare is somehow empty. So that means it is time for a skincare shopping spree. I love shopping. I'm gonna spend all my money and I'm gonna be so sad afterwards, but right now I am so happy. We're hitting up four different stores to hunt down the top skincare products. From each store, we need to be finding a cleanser, toner, serum, and moisturizer. Let's see which products are gonna keep my skin healthy, happy, and glowing, and which products are not gonna do that. Starting off with Target. Let's go. Rule number one, it must be very easy to find. We get in, we get it, we get out. Rule number two, it needs to be cheap. Your girl ain't spending $50 on a serum because my face cannot afford that. Rule number three, it's gotta have a very positive reaction on my skin. Ain't no way I'm gonna be breaking out with the products we're buying. Rule number four, our least favorite one and our least favorite friend, the app ratings. It's gotta have a good app rate. This is so awkward. Rule number five, my overall rating because in the end, it's how I feel about it. I gotta feel good in my skin and be happy with the product, so let's go before this is embarrassing. Cleanser, check. Tonic, number one, check. Serum, check. I have a confession to make. I love to follow the crowd and fit in with everyone else. I mean, same clothes, same style, all of that. And it's been a real struggle for me growing up, but I'm kind of starting to notice that maybe being unique is better. Having our own personalities, our own style. Face lotion, check. I think we're looking good, but you know something that I started to notice actually? All of these products look so different. Like the packaging on every single one of them is completely different and unique. Not to mention their benefits are completely different. So maybe we got go something going for us with that. Store number two. I'm not really finding any um, facial products. Got it, cleanser, check. It's kind of a strange uh, cleanser, but it'll work, right? Everything's unique. There's literally no elf here. Oh my gosh, they said they're gonna close in five minutes, so I gotta go. Here we go, toner, done. Come on, come on, come on, moisturizer, moisturize. Okay, I guess this counts as a moisturizer. Moisturizer, check. I'm very curious to see how this store is gonna compare to the last two. Everything's been so different. There are a lot of similarities though, which I guess in a way is good. I guess I'm learning a lot more than just skincare here. Every single item is so different and so unique. I mean, we got Aquaphor, which by the way, Aquaphor is good, we learned that from the last video. It belongs in the lip gold, so. Oh, wait, this is super cute. I have never seen this brand. See, if I wouldn't have come here, I wouldn't have found something unique and different. Toner and serum. Check and check. Okay, that's cool. Calm and Restore Oak Gel Moisturizer. Unique. Check. I am loving this store. I'm getting so many new products, but I'm also learning a ton about other things, I guess, like personality. And last but not least, we've got Walmart. It's like vacant here at the moment. I guess nobody likes to go uh, shopping at midnight. I don't know about you, I love it. Although I do have to admit that all of my most impulsive decisions and buys happen at midnight, so we're sticking to the four items. First of all, cleanser. Cleanser, check. Toner, check. <gasps> Serum, check. I may have made some more impulsive decisions, but that's okay. What's the next one? Ah, moisturizer. Um. Oh, okay, this is cool. Moisturizer, check. We got everything going. Let's go home and now try all of these items. Honey, I'm home! And guess who came back with all the products? I'm... Okay, we're fine. I don't know how I have this much energy at midnight, but I am all for it. This is gonna be super fun. We'll see how I'm feeling afterwards, after I have washed 
toned, serumed, and moisturized my face at least four different times, but I'm doing this for us. We gotta really figure this out, find which products are gonna be the ones that I continue to use, and hopefully you'll find some good ones for you as well. I don't think we can really wash my face here, so here we go. And we're here. Welcome to my wonderful bathroom. Let us get out the products, probably. Okay, well, this is gonna be a lot on my face, but it is important. Can we just talk about the fact that, as I've already said, they're all very different? I mean, they're all very different colors, they all have different purposes. I mean, liquid sunscreen moisturizer versus daily normal moisturizer. Oh, this one also has SPF in it. There's gotta be something in here that's gonna fit with me and what works best for my face and makes me feel the best, basically. Okay, we're gonna start us off with Walgreens, I guess. This one was very unique and different because they actually had the toner and serum together. Now, starting off with our ratings, number one, they were not the easiest to find. Walgreens did not have everything that we wanted, so that one's gonna get a... Affordable pricing, they weren't exactly the cheapest. Toner and serum was $23.99. I don't know that I'm gonna be spending $23.99 on a toner and serum. However, they do come together. This African black soap was $5. This one, not that bad. And the daily moisturizer came up to $25.99. So affordable pricing, we're gonna say positive reaction on my skin. I don't know, let's test it out. Okay, this smell is actually so amazing, and it's actually pretty soft on my face. Like, it's not that terrible. It is a lotion tonic and serum. Oh, that's in a different language, just kidding. It's a clarifying toner and serum. I guess it is nice though that the tonic and serum come together, but at the same time, I worry. You know how they have three-in-one shampoos? Like, what if it's like that? Yeah, so far, I think my face is feeling pretty good about it. However, it does need some moisturizer, so. If there's one thing I know about my face, it's that it gets dry super quickly, so I need like very, very moisturizing moisturizers. I don't know, I personally like the ones that are a little bit more oily, and this one really feels like it's just sunscreen, which will be beneficial, especially now in the summertime, because your girl is gonna be outside. This is not tinted at all. I personally am not liking this that much. I mean, I'm sure it moisturizes really well. I don't know, I just don't like it. I also just look pale right now. I look like Casper the Ghost. Overall, I'm gonna say that I give it like a seven out of 10, but it's still not exactly the best. However, let's see what our frenemy over here has to say about it. But now here are what the app's ratings were. So I guess the app also did not approve of these items. However, I don't like it, but this is what it told us. So still I'm giving it a seven out of 10. Next up we've got Walmart, which I'm actually really excited because all of these items are ones that I have wanted to try and I've seen them all over TikTok. For starters, they were definitely very easy to find. All of the skincare products were in two different aisles, so 10 out of 10 on that one. Affordable pricing, they were decent. I've gotta say ITK had some good prices. I think all of them were pretty good, except for maybe the Neutrogena. But overall, I give it a pretty good, eight out of 10. Now, positive reaction on my face. Let's try it out. <clears throat> okay, it just like came out of the bottle actually. Um, maybe that's not the best. Oh, smell is amazing. It's very soft on my skin. Okay, this is the cutest bottle ever. Let's try this out. Okay, I personally love the milky toners because I need all the hydration on my face. Now let's see what this Hydro Boost water gel stuff is all about. If I can open it. I, whatever the rating was that I last said, I give it a Three out of 10. This thing is tiny and it's expensive too. Oh my gosh, that just went into the garbage. That's so disgusting. Ew, 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 ew. 
This is like sample size. Well, let's try it. It is definitely milkier. Like it's definitely more the style that my face needs. It is making my face feel actually quite fantastic. Was it worth the amount for this tiny, tiny amount? Maybe not, but I feel good in my skin. Actually, okay, there's a little bit of burning. I don't know if that's just because this is the second time washing my face or if that's like actually burning my face. Here's what the app is telling us. I'm actually quite surprised. This got 100% and this one, Got a pretty high score. These other two, not as much. They were poor, but they weren't terrible. So I guess now that I've waited a little longer, I feel like this stuff is actually pretty good on my skin. Maybe it's just the fact that the app told us it was 100%, but still, for positive reactions to my skin, I give it a pretty good. And also, high app ratings was pretty good as well. So overall, I say this one was a eight out of 10. I don't know if any of the other ones will beat this one. Let's check. Next up, we had CVS. These ones actually turned out pretty good. I am actually very excited to use this micellar water because I have used it all the time. And personally, I'm already giving it a 10 out of 10, so here we go. And this stuff can be used also as makeup remover. Already the micellar water is getting all of my wins. Toner. Okay, this toner's a bit rougher actually. Serum. Okay, bougie. This tree of life serum, very chicy. Sorry, by the way, when I say chicy, chicy is uh, Portuguese for bougie. Except it's not exactly bougie, but I can't figure out another way of saying it, so I just say chicy. If you're watching to this point, which you better be, and you are the OGs if you are still here right now, you gotta comment how chicy. Ooh, I like this little dropper thingy. Up until this point, I haven't used much skin. Oh, it's burning. Oh, it's burning so badly. Okay. Nope, 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 nope. Okay. No, I'm doing, taking that off. Uh, not my favorite. Yeah, so that serum was a big no-go for me because that stuff was seriously burning up my face. However, this liquid sunscreen moisturizer compared to the other one, I'm actually liking this one a lot more. It definitely is a little bit oilier, but as a normal moisturizer that I'd use every single day, it's still not the one. So here's all the ratings. That was actually quite surprising. Zero out of 100. However, it did say that it was only like one or two of the things that were like a risk. So I don't really understand. So easy to find. Yeah, I'd say they were decent. So. Kind of. Affordable pricing, this came out to be $8, $11.99, $19.49, and $14.79. So affordable pricing, they were they were decent actually. Positive reaction on my skin, I'd say they were pretty good, except for this one. This one I give a huge no. And my overall rating, I'm gonna give it a good seven out of 10. Who's not bad? And last but not least, we've got Target. Okay, I'm actually pretty excited to try this. Here we go. Okay, I actually love the feeling of this one. I don't care what the app said, I love this stuff and I'm gonna be using it all summer long. What the? So this cleanses like a oil. Whoa, this is crazy and it feels crazy too. Whatever I had on my face last, I think the sun bum stuff, when this stuff touches it, it becomes like jelly. Like, see that? See how it's like jelly? That's crazy. I don't know if that's good or not. I guess we'll see with the app. I hate that thing so much. Okay, this stuff is burning my face too. Ow! Oh, why is it burning my face? Usually CeraVe is really good. Man, is that stuff burning. It's a ultra lightweight. That stuff is like ultra. Fire well, easy to find, I'd say that, yeah, these were pretty easy to find. They're all around the same area and very clearly there. Affordable pricing, the serum was $5.99. Bioma was $12.99. Pixie was $15. And CeraVe was $15.89. So in terms of pricing, I'd say the Bioma as well as the Good Molecules were really great. 
CeraVe and Pixie, not as great. I probably wouldn't buy them again. Positive reaction to my skin. I'd give most of them a huge thumbs up, except for that CeraVe lotion. High app ratings, here's what the ratings were. So I guess these two that I loved the most I actually got a really high score, which is a win-win. And then my overall rating, I give this one a nine out of 10. But I guess this was our, in the end, perfect routine. Coming in first place, I gotta say the micellar water was my favorite as a cleanser. However, this bioma definitely came in second. It was not that bad. So these two, highly recommend and I'm definitely gonna be using them in my daily routine. Now for the toner, nothing beat the ITK. I love the feeling of this. I don't know if it's just because it is a hydrating milky toner or what, but I felt really good in my skin when I was using this toner. So this was by far my favorite toner. Now for serum, nothing beat this hyaluronic acid serum. I loved this stuff, not to mention it got great ratings and it was not that bad in pricing, so Good molecules, you best believe I'm probably gonna be buying a lot more from you. And then for our moisturizers, I've gotta say that Sunbum, but also Neutrogena were my favorites. Even though this was the smallest thing in the world and definitely was expensive, I felt great and my skin looked fantastic. And this too, even though the app, whatever the app said, forget what the app said, I felt good in it. It made me happy, not to mention it has a 50 SPF, so it's gotta be good for you. So those were my favorite, and honestly, I feel really great in them. However, besides finding my perfect skincare routine items, I've gotta say I definitely learned something. We all need to be unique, and it's okay if I wear clothes differently, if my hair looks different than others, because I'm special, and so are you. You're special exactly the way you are, and we all need to embrace the way that we are, because if we all were the exact same, remember, just like all these cleansers and toners and serums and whatnot, life would be boring. So check out this video, come hang out with me right now because I'm enjoying hanging out with you and you gotta come hang out with me more and I will see you there.